Hello everyone, so in this video, I want to show you jobs with visa sponsorship and in occupations that are so unlikely, like you can actually migrate as a chef, as a hairstylist, you know, those occupations that people don't feel they can get jobs, you know, with visa sponsorship on. So that's why I'm doing this video to show you these jobs. They are available. They have visa sponsorship. They have relocation package to pay for your flight, accommodation, like you know different kinds of relocation packages these jobs do exist but you just need to know the right place to find them so in this video i'm bringing them together to just show you you know jobs you can apply for different occupations with visa sponsorship if you're just meeting my name is jackie and you're welcome to my channel do hit the subscribe button so you can be seeing more videos from me and turn on the post notification bell very important so how the bell works is when you turn it on Every time I post a new video, you get a notification and you just click it and watch the video. So in this relocation journey, right, you can't depend on just one video. You need to like get so much information so you can know your options. It will even make your journey faster when you know like so much about the things you need to do to migrate. So you need to watch a lot of videos from me, you know, to make your relocation dream come true. I mean, that is what my channel is all about. It's all about, you know, showing you opportunities all around the world that you can take advantage of. So do me a favor, hit the like button of this video, you know, just give me a thumbs up just to show that you appreciate the content I share here. It does motivate me to create more content all right thank you so much okay so i'm going to show you the website let's move over to the website so i can show you everything you need to know about these visa sponsorship jobs you can apply for right now all right so let me show you these new jobs in canada that you can apply for they are so new these jobs were posted today the march 15th so you can apply for them immediately so you're one of those to send in your application okay so i do this so i can you know people can know that they can apply for jobs in different occupations not just healthcare or it any occupation at all once you have the skill you can apply so this is for truck driver supervisors and all they need is secondary school certificate and one year experience so you can see the responsibilities so if this is something you can do if you're a truck driver supervisor then you can apply for this so you can get jobs in different occupations once you have the skills you have the certification you can apply for jobs you can move abroad on different occupations okay and that's why i like to show these occupations in my videos so you can know they do exist okay so this is the email address to send in the application to so send in your CV and cover letter to that email address. So if you want to see the link, you can check my Telegram channel for the link of this job and all the jobs. They're going to be in my Telegram channel. And the link to my Telegram channel is in the description box below. So join my channel to see the links. Or alternatively, you can also see the links here on the top. You know, you can see it on the screen, right? So this, the, the link is right here on the screen. So you can copy it out and paste on your your you know search box or whatever and you're gonna go there okay so that's it let's see some other one this is for general construction supervisor another supervisory role and what they need is secondary school and um, two years experience and two vacancies for this okay so these are the responsibilities so if this sounds like you then this is the email address to send in the application Always remember to add your cover letter when you apply for jobs. Don't send CV only. Okay, so if this task looks like something you can do, then go ahead and apply for this role, okay? So like I always say, try to be the best candidate because it's highly competitive. Many people are applying for this, not just you. So have a very good CV, okay, as you're applying for jobs. All right, so email address to send the application is right there. So next up is a landscape leverer and five vacancies for this. Salary is $19 per hour for 32 hours per week of work, okay? So if you're a landscape leverer, then you can apply for this job. It's a permanent role in Canada. So no degree, no certificate, no diploma, so no education requirements for this. And the work experience is one year, so less than two years. And you're going to be working in various locations. Obviously, as 
a landscape laborer, you'll be going from place to place to work. So that's how it is. So these are the tasks. Assist with landscape constructions, rake and collect refuse, cut and spread topsoils and other materials, you know, and others. So just see the list. If it's what you can do, then you now go ahead and apply, okay? So this is the email address to send in your application to send it to that email address and you're good, okay? So do apply as soon as possible. Next up is web designer. So if you're a web designer, you can apply for this. Salary is $35 per hour. So what they need is college certificates, you know, so you don't even need a degree for this. So basically, like I said earlier, it's all about your skills. How do you have experience? You know, have you done this? How good are you? And all, and how can you capture all of this in your CV, right? So you really need to have a very good CV. And then seven months experience for this. So if you have all these, you know, skills, this is a list of skills. If you can do all of this, right? If you're good in all of this, then you can go ahead and apply for this job. So email address to send your application is this. So this is it right here. Send your application to that email address to apply for the position of a web designer. Okay. So you can see there are different occupations, so many. So this is for education director, education director. So let's see what do we have here. 40 hours of work. $42.30 per hour. So this is like a Monday to Friday, eight hours kind of work. And they need a bachelor's degree for this bachelor's degree. So obviously you're an education director. So yes, of course, you have to be educated, okay? So work experience is one year. Benefits, dental plan, healthcare plan, financial benefits, you know, you have bonus as well. And then life insurance, free parking, so send in your application to this email address here. You can apply directly on Job Bank. So, you know, it's written here, you must include your cover letter. So you, you see what I said earlier, cover letter is like so important. I see people apply for jobs without a cover letter. It's not so good for you. You know, always add a cover letter as you send applications. Next up is a construction helper, $20 per hour, 32 hours per week. And I need five people for this five vacancies no degree no certificate no diploma no, no experience they say they will train but obviously like i always say even when they say no experience is required people with experience are going to be applying so just try to have experience for whatever you're applying for and then that's the email address to send your application to so remember all these links will be in my telegram channel or you just copy out the url you know up here so this is for a kitchen helper secondary school and they will train you they said they will train accommodation is available so accommodation is available for this and these are your tasks so if this is something you can do then why not go ahead and apply for the job so let's see the email address that you're going to be sending this to okay these are all the tasks right clean and sanitize items um, clear and clean tables, trays and chairs, operate dishwashers and all of that, a, lo a whole lot of things. Kitchen helper, obviously, you're going to be doing things like that. So this is how to apply. You apply on job bank, right? So these are the instructions. Do follow the instructions for application, okay? And then that is that. So you can copy out the URL and check the job out so this is for a landscaping supervisor so earlier we had landscaping laborers yeah so this is the supervisor that will be supervising the other laborers so secondary school is needed and obviously you need experience if you're going to be supervising others so the email address where you're going to be sending your application to is right here so sending your application to that email address to apply for this position of a landscape supervisor okay so let's see the next one cleaning supervisor another supervisory role so you know the task of a cleaner so here you hire and train or arrange for training or cleaning staff you supervise and coordinate activities of workers you know supervise cleaners basically that's what the job entails one year experience and the email address to send your application is right here. So that's the email where you'll be sending your application to. So do that as soon as possible, okay? 
So what's the next thing here? Let's see. Carpenter. So are you a carpenter? Then apply for this. Three years experience is needed for this job. So if you've been a carpenter for three years, that's the email address to send your application to right there. And the next one is for a concrete finisher. Three years experience also. So if you're a concrete finisher, you've done that for at least three years then send your application to this email address right here, okay? I really think you should apply to these jobs like immediately, you know, because at times if they see what they are looking for, even before the deadline, you know, they can close receiving applications. So apply as soon as possible and also share the opportunity with others. Let them know that these jobs do exist so they can apply for them. So give this video a thumbs up if you found it valuable. And also subscribe to the channel for more videos like this. If you want to talk to me privately, you want to have a one-on-one -on -one consultation with me, I do that, you know, because there's so much information out there and some people don't really know how to like which one is for them which pathway is best for them so the purpose of this one-on-one -on -one sessions is basically to let people know you know the right pathway for them in terms of their qualification their experience their budget you know and things like that so if you want to talk to me privately to get a good sense of which pathways you should be pursuing then do send me an email and we will arrange that all right thank you so much for watching my name is jackie and i will see you in my next video Thank you.